this is 911. What emergency service do you require? Thank you. The fire department are en route to your location. Hello, hello. Good to see you, Slick. Devin, the hell are you doing here? It's over, Michael. You done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're, you're like my spirit brother now. Where's Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard's idiot son, to agree to tear this relic down and let me redevelop the area for condos. <laughs> in this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax-free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael! They're fucking us! The suits! And they don't even wear suits! Wolves in turds clothing! Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? Look, people used to like films, now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their iFruit phones. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. Gentlemen, Molly. Namaste. Can I take the film now, Mr. Richards? My plane leaves in 25 minutes. Can't we do something? At least let me finish the picture, then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. Where the hell is she going with that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog! God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? No, he can't do anything, pal. It's an inevitability. <sighs> My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? 
Fuck that! I'm a producer! Nobody fucks with my film! Get to the airport, talk to her, that's it. Slow it down, Slick. You're not thinking. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my movie. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. Assess to all available units. Requesting an escort for Molly Schultz to Devon Weston Hangar at LS International. Be advised that Miss Schultz is in a highly charged state.
Under the circumstances, about to knock off a federal government building. Well, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. Franklin got us what we need. Put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So, I'm guessing drapes and... Cindy Candle aren't gonna do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. We will have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bombs, meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well, under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. Hey, what's happening, Michael? Ah, uh, my shift's about to start down at the FIB building. You know, get Gustavo and Norm on board. Be ready for my signal in the fire truck. Okay, at least half the crew is serious. But we'll be ready to do this thing, dawg. Just clear your pass with security, and you can go up. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Thirty.
Watch out, kids. The glamour of fighting crime with statistics in the FIV. In case you needed proof, coffee was a diuretic. They don't work so hard. We're all leaving in a minute. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Shit's in motion, people. We raiding the bureau. Y'all ready for this? In and out, homies. Let's do it. You gotta watch out, fool. <laughs> Detonate the incendiaries, Frank. I'll get this turnout gear on. Assistance required. In, uh... Northern Mamesa. Whoa! <laughs> All right. We're first response. Let's go. Out of one. So, Lester hijacked the emergency signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So, don't worry. Report 
before it comes down on our head. Get in the truck! as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute, they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys in the building you took down. If they knew, who else is gonna know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Oh, trust me. I'm gonna get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit, shit. I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. Haha, <laughs> you're right. So, uh, take us to our get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. All right, man, I... Try. Try real hard, okay? Cool. Drive us to Lester's. Now that we're clear, I can probably tell you people, oh, I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a dude, man. Oh, yeah, shit. I don't like speaking ill of the department, know what I'm saying? But that dude was in over his head. Yeah, he wasn't top draw, but I thought we could carry him through it. I guess I thought wrong. Well, anyway, we made it out, so we got that to be thankful for. Norm's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Man, you really gonna miss him, huh? Hey, I don't like losing any of my crew. But, uh, Norm was special. He liked you, man. Hey, he looked up to me, maybe. Man, when well, looking up to you, you got that poor fool killed. Be careful! Hey! Hey, this Lester crib, ain't it? Keep your heads down, you hear? <laughs> well. What? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! Ah! Ah! Fucking A Ray, we oh. did it! Ow! Ah! How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility? It was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> Come here. Give me oh, some of that. Hey, ow, ah, ow, ow, ow. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot <laughs> my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm Ooh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <coughs> man, that's some foul ass shit! <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square things up with Davey and Dick Wild. Uh, for serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. <laughs> 